Welcome back to Home Lab Networks. My name is AJ, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to install TrueNAS on Proxmox. So let's jump straight into the video. So first, we need to download the ISO file. Download, and depending on your internet connection, it could take a couple minutes. Download. There's not even a gig. It shouldn't take too long. My internet connection isn't the best, so can't do a whole lot. And just take in mind the TrueNAS requirements. The file has finished in downloading. Head to your Proxmox server. And click on local. ISO images. And then upload your file. Once it says task OK, exit this and let's create the virtual machine. Give it a name. TrueNAS Next now, um, Select that ISO image that's just been uploaded TrueNAS Now again, I'm not going to go by what's recommended for the purpose of this video, but I suggest you follow what's recommended So I'm just going to keep this all at default I'll give it Two calls. Try and give it more if you can. Memory, we'll give it four gigabytes. And I'm going to change this to the card. Finish. Once your virtual machine is created, before we start it up, we want to go to hardware and we want to add a few drives because once TrueNAS is installed, there's an area where you need to configure your drives into what they are and you can't do, it, do that from one hard drive so you've got to configure like a pool of hard drives for XYZ so we need to add a few more hard drives so we are able to do that so just go to hardware add a hard disk and we'll just add another two so we'll just give this one 20 gig And we'll add one more. So all up, there'll be three drives. And just for for this for the sake of this, we'll just give it ten. So boot installer, press enter, enter, installed on disk one. Create a new password for this machine. BIOS and now we'll just let it install. So once you see this page we're gonna put this IP address into the, into the internet browser and this should take us to the TrueNAS web page. So https colon slash slash 192.168.1.127 enter. So we haven't got a certificate which is fine, so our own network. So TrueNAS, so the username is root and the password is what you set through the installation. And here we go. Now, I haven't used a whole lot of, lot of this myself. I still want to improve my knowledge on it and how it all works. But that's how you ins install it. Go storage, go pools. Th this way you set up all your pools for your drives. Your disk, there's, there's all the disk that we have installed on this machine. And then sharing, this is where you'll set up like the network share so you, you can mount it to your Windows machine and just access it from your file explorer. So once that, once that's all set up properly, you go to network and it will come under here instead of having to actually go to the web interface and then using it from there. Settings you can for your hardware and so use your more cores in your CPU, more RAM and have a load of hard drive storage but that, that's the basic setup on TrueNAS on Proxmox so if you like this video give it a thumbs up if not subscribe if you haven't and we'll see you guys in the next video mm -hmm.